Ladies and gentlemen, I am back. And yes, I did say that I was going to take a hiatus. And um, yes, I did say that I'm changing my channel to be more like a West Wing channel. And this is going to be its first episode. Um, so, right. Happy holidays, ladies and gentlemen. And <clears throat> for Christmas, I got the brand new Intercontinental Championship. This title was introduced back in 2019 through 2022. Um, the history of the Intercontinental Champion began with, um, Pat Patterson, which began in the 1970s, and the whole in total of the Intercontinental Champion is Walter, also known as Yumpo, but most people like to call him Walter. So, you have to, if I have to impel, um, this title, I, I'm pretty sure most people say that it's like the 24-7 championship, which I kind of see, but I don't know why people are comparing it to the 24-7 title. In my opinion, it kind of looks like um, the AEW championship and the NXT Women's Championship. Because when you look at the shape of this title belt, um, it looks with one plate of the belt looks similar to the um, NXT Women's Championship belt. Now I, now I know that most people say that this should have been the new um, Universal Championship, but to be honest, for the Intercontinental Championship, um, I actually like this look for the Intercontinental Championship. And plus, um, we needed a new one for a while back in 2019, so yeah, it looks pretty good. I actually like the front, the front plate. But so it decides. Um, the side plates were actually good. They look similar to any other side plates. Um, if I had to swipe this belt, this belt kind of a little bit looks like the United States Championship. Because, um, how the way um, they design them, they kind of look a little bit similar. And yeah, the plates, the side plates were actually good. I actually like the way that they look. And um, I actually like that they put the, uh, um, that it has a new strap around it. It makes it look really nice. Um, I don't know if they're going to be using Hello Straps for um, the United States Championship and the Intercontinental Championship, which I hope not because um, these are um, mid held titles. And... It would be real to um, put different hello straps around them. But yeah. So one of my favorite Intercontinental Champions in WWE. Well, my top five are Drew McIntyre, Helvet Hingston, um, Jeff Hardy, The Miz, and um, one more. It would have to be, um, let me think, let me think. Dolph Ziggler. Yes, Dolph Ziggler. But anyways, I really like the, um, this new Intercontinental Championship design. It looks actually really good. I'm not gonna lie. And, yeah, like I said, I'm changing this channel to be more like a wrestling channel. Um, the belt design looks actually good and um let me know if you want want me to want me to tag your more wrestling belt designs in the future and yeah um happy holidays everybody this is a really short youtube video because um it's the holidays and i wanted to post something and i want to show up um, one of my christmas gifts so yeah i hope you all have a happy holidays um, next time, yes, I am changing this channel to be more like a professional wrestling channel, and, um, most of it's going to be prediction videos, like I've been doing in the past. Uh, most of it's going to be, like, um, toy videos, like me playing with my toys, like some other YouTubers do. And some of them are going to be, like, reviews of Raw, SmackDown, and AEW. Um, NXT, um, I, I'll, I'll see about that.
web page, same thing. I'll, I'll see if I decide to tag your NXT and web page. Anyways, um, yeah, happy holidays, everybody. Like, comment, and subscribe. Always be a champion. And I'm out.